Anthony Garnica, your third pro fight this Friday. Yes, sir, yes, sir, bro. Yeah, on the Golden Boy card. How do you feel about the opportunity, man? Talk to you know, us about it. Amazing opportunity, you know. It's a big stage for me. Oh, yeah. You're gonna have family there? Yeah, yeah, a lot of family and friends coming down to support. Yeah. So what do you want to do, man? Like, you want to impress them or you just, whatever happens as long as you get the win? You know, me and uh, my coaches, are. we have a game plan and I want to stick to it, you know? Talk to us about Roger Reese, man. He's the one backing you and all this. He believes in you. Yeah, you know, he's putting a lot of support. Uh, he's helping me a lot. You know, he's, he's been there from the start, you know. What are you learning, man? How, how do you, how's your progress as a professional now? Because last time we spoke, I don't think we had, had a fight yet. Yeah, you know, my eyes are open, you know, like, especially after uh, Andy Ruiz. has been living with him, training with him, you know. You lived with him? Yeah. Oh, roommate. that's cool. That's my roommate. That's yeah. dope, bro. How do you know that? Yeah. How long? For like six, six months. No Supposed way! Yeah, yeah. That's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, how is he, bro? As a person, I know he's a cool person because yeah. I've talked to him many times. But like, just living with him's gotta be different. Yeah. How's that? I mean, yeah, it's different from the gym and, and from like home. You know, it's That's just crazy. He's he's real cool guy. Funny, funny guy. Yeah. Were you living with him heading into the fight, or was it? Yeah, yeah. Heading into, into the, the Joshua fight. Joshua fight. Oh, and the shit. Preview and, uh, and the one before that one. That's crazy. Yeah. So obviously. You're there with him. You see him picking his mind. Um, how was he going into that fight, man? You know, Did he know he was gonna win? Because obviously, I mean, he yeah. knows he's gonna win. But yeah, there was a lot of doubters, you know. But he always had it in his in his mind, you know, that he was gonna win. He was physically. There was never no doubt. Never no doubt. That's crazy, you know, bro. Physically ready, mentally ready. You know? Yeah. And and how does that like motivate or inspire you? Just watching him go through that and having lived with him for six months, man. You know, it, it motivates me, you know, because uh, he was training for this fight so so hard you know and he made it happen you know and, and it motivates me because that's where I want to be one day yeah so what do you see what do you take from seeing him accomplish and, and reach those heights and what is it going to take for you what is it what exactly is that one thing that's going to take you to the top you know it's just pushing myself you know staying humble grounded you know dedication that's... and you have Manny Robles as your trainer to talk to us about the chemistry with him the guys been together for like maybe two years now I think yeah yeah you know really really good coach the chemistry is good. He's been teaching me a lot of new things, you know, because in the pros is different from the amateurs, you know. And I made this transition with Coach Manny, and he's been teaching me a lot. He lost a lot of fighters, and you were one of the very few that he got early on after losing um, Oscar Valdez, uh, Diego Magdaleno, and all those other guys. Yeah. How, where was he at mentally? Like, because I know he's expressed it before that he was, you know, he was, he was in a tough situation yeah. mentally. Like, he, he almost felt like quitting yeah. boxing, yeah. but he didn't because of his family. He explained yeah. Yeah, how you know, things were. You know, he's a very strong. He's a very strong guy. You know, he when he when he got down to the gym, that's his. That's he loves what he does. You know, he shows every fighter 100 percent. And you know, you go in the gym every day, like like if nothing, you know, he just work with us. He'll talk to us. You know. Yeah. Who have you been sparring? Because they got a lot of names over there, man. Yeah, a lot of a lot of good people. A lot of people from here in Westside would go down to the gym, you know, Oscar Negrete would help me out a lot, you know, Brandon, Brandon Valdez, another stable mate, some real good work. The Colombian guys. Yeah. yeah. Um, and anything you picked up from, like, any of the top names there, man? Like, any advice that they've given you that, that has, like, rubbed off and... You know, it's just, it's just staying disciplined, you know, staying humble, you know, things things will get tough and, you know, you have to uh, keep that focus. Yeah. What are your goals, man? What, what is the future hold for uh, Anthony Garnica? You know, I just want to prove everybody that, that I got it, you know, I want to, my goal, my ultimate goal is to become world champ, you know, yeah. and I, I want to work hard for that. Yeah. You have a good amateur background too, was it like 100, 90, 90 fights? It was uh, 100, 110 fights. Yeah, so, so you, you obviously put in the work to be a yeah. professional now. Yeah. Do, you, do you feel that everything's paying off, just finally being here now as a pro that all the hard work as a young man uh, is finally paying off? Is yeah, it? you know, it, it was a real good amateur experience, you know, I started when I was seven, I had my first fight when I was eight. And, you know, all the amateur tournaments, all the, the qualifiers, you know, I think that helped me out a lot because all the different styles that are out there, you know. Yeah, okay. Let's think I ask you a bit about a big fight, July 20th, Manny Pacquiao versus Keith Thurman. What happens? You know, on this one, I, I'm, I'm pulling for Pacquiao, you know. Pacquiao, never, under, never underestimate Pacquiao. You know? he's, he's still got it. Yeah. Also, the main event on this card, uh, the rematch between um, Alberto Machado and Andrew Cancion. How do you see that fight playing out? You know, I don't really have a favorite for that fight, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be a, a really good fight, just like the first one. Okay. okay, tell the fans where to follow you on social media. Follow me on Instagram, Anthony underscore Garnica. All right, cool. Appreciate you, man. All right, bro. Thank I'll you.